как оператор, он великолепный был оператор. Незаменимый. Ну, это как бы наша старая школа, скажем так, еще. Вот классическая. Новости, программа, документалка. Ты мог снимать все. Но это человек, который всю жизнь болеет своей работой. Болел. И только в ней себя видел. Евгений Сакунд, a cameraman for the Cave Live TV channel, died on March 1st near the Baban Yar Memorial during a rocket attack by Russian troops on a Kyiv TV tower. He was one of five civilians whose lives were claimed by the attack that day and the first media worker to be killed in a Russian invasion. The aggressor seeks to wipe out any mention of his crimes from the face of the earth. Therefore, they kill all possible witnesses, military, civilians and journalists. If cameraman Yevgeny Sakun had not been killed, he could have filmed a story about how the Russian military tried to cut off Ukrainians from access to truthful information. In this story, it would be told that the Russians fired at 10 TV towers throughout Ukraine, how the Russian military blocked the editorial offices of the Ukrainian media in the occupied cities. The world would know that at least 70 regional media were forced to stop working due to threats from the Russian occupiers, and the building of the public television in Kherson was completely mined. The killings and shootings of media workers are a gross violation of international law. The enemy can turn a blind eye to laws, but he cannot close the eyes of the world to crimes. After all, honoring the memory of those who died for the truth, we will continue to tell their immortal stories.